First met fourth in an unexpected top of the table clash at the Stade du Moustoir on Sunday lunchtime as Lorient welcomed the champions Paris Saint-Germain. The host's surprisingly fast start to the season had taken a slight hit in recent weeks though, with three games without a win. Christophe Galtier's side meanwhile entered on the back of a minor European disappointment. Despite beating Juventus on their own patch, they were pipped to top spot by Benfica in extraordinary circumstances. Identical results, goal difference, goals scored, a pair of draws in their head-to-heads. The Portuguese side eventually coming out on top by away goals scored. And the away goal would suit PSG just fine here. They came close to one early on. And Mboga doing well to deny Neymar from close range. Shortly after though, it would all go wrong for the keeper. Lorient playing themselves into trouble as they try to play out from the back. Vogo closed down by Neymar, slipping. Ekesike returning it to the Brazilian who took his time and picked his spot for 1 0. Painful for Vogo in every sense. An 11th goal this season for Neymar. Kylian Mbappe calling for the pass, but PSG's number 10 preferring to finish it himself and join his strike partner at the top of the scoring charts on this occasion. Vogo unfortunately forced off with the injury he picked up during the goal, replaced by Vito Manone, the veteran Italian making his Lorient bow, and you'd have to say somewhat thrown in at the deep end. A reassuring first touch though, as he saved a Sergio Ramos header at his near post. And then a more impressive second save as he denied the charging Mbappe. Powerful low shot, the keeper quickly down with a strong right hand. So Lorient kept themselves within touching distance through to the break. They'd won just one of their previous 15 games against Paris in the top flight. If they were to make that two in 16, they'd have to come from behind to beat the champions. But after the break, Lemelu would hit back. Advantage played by the referee. And they would take advantage. A nice team move, culminating in a lovely pass through by Enzo Lafay for Terem Moffi. Nigerian leaving it to Lefay, latching on to the midfielder's pass and beating Gianluigi Donnarumma at his near post. Moffi becomes the first African player to score nine goals in the first 14 games of the French top flight since Benjamin Mukanjo in 2015. He nearly made it 10 a few minutes later. Near carbon copy as Lefay found Moffi again. This time, he could only find the underside of the bar. After a quiet second half, it was the inevitable Parisians who would grab the final goal with 10 minutes remaining. Neymar's corner headed home by Danilo Pereira. Getting to the ball ahead of Dango Atara and heading high above Minone. An assist for Neymar to go with his goal as his fantastic season continues. So perhaps missing Leo Messi, absent with an inflammation of his Achilles, Nonetheless, PSG strike late to make it four consecutive wins and restore their five-point lead at the summit. They're now unbeaten in their last 30 matches in all competitions for just the third time in their history.